Welcome back to the Community Spotlight. Today we take a look at the BMK 1300 Light Freight Train by Sleepyhead. Let's get started. All right, so we're going to do a few more than just one today. Yesterday I tried to do the ship and get through a few more, but it took so long to crash the ship and get off the ship that I only did one. But today we're going to be doing this train and a few more others. So let's take a look at this. It says Morpheus BMK 1300 Light Freight. And uh, we're going to get on, but first let's just kind of check it out. It looks really nice. It's a very nice little design. Compact. It's probably based on a real one, I'm guessing. And let's see if we can get on. Uh, there we go. We've got the aluminum texture down there. We've got walkway. Walkway. Disconnect. I don't know what that does, but okay. Ooh. What's this? Valve power. Radiator power. This seems like stuff we should turn on. So we're going to turn it on. All right. Easy. Engine compartment. I, all this stuff is not on. Seems like there's no power to it. So we must have to go... Uh-oh. Is there an on switch in here that I didn't see? Engine says no electric. But where do you turn on the electric? Hmm. Let's see. Is there like an on electric button somewhere here? Jump back on. Oh, what's this? Disconnect. No, that's not it. I don't think it's on top. That would make for a silly train. Okay. Uh, hmm. Okay, there's a button here. Let's try this button. Power hatch. Oh. Oh! Look at this! Holy moly. Okay. Engine system. Do you really have to do this on a real train? I don't even know. That's crazy. Okay, oops. Turn all these on. Emergency battery? Nah, we don't need that yet. Door system. Oh, there we go. Ooh. All right. Shut that up. Open the cab. Oh, there's like a little tiny entry in there. All right. Ooh. Wow. I was not expecting this. All right. Well, let's sit down in our seat here. Oh, is it going? Oh, he puts it on the seat and it goes on. Cool. All right. Let's see here. Probably need pumps or something. Well, I've already turned on the pumps in the back, right? Spotlights, lights, camera change, IR, horn, cab lights. <gasps> Radio. No, we're good, I think. All right. Increase brake power? Throttle? Clutch? What's that one? Door again? Yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, I think this should be as easy as turning a key. I thought I saw a key. Didn't I see a key? Oh, there's a key. All right. That's easy. Oh, wait. Throttle. Increase brake? No. Throttle. Okay. Are you on? No. Why not? Why aren't you on? Oh, I don't like this door. But this one. Okay, let's go back here. What's this? Okay, we turned all these. Oh, wait. Do I have to push the buttons? <gasps> oh, I have to push the buttons. Okay, okay. Look at this. Without directions. I am awesome. All right. Uh, ignition. Yeah, that sounds better. Whee! All right, let's get that clutch going. Clutch, clutch. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, it's fast. Wait, do I not want to do that? Um, do I want to turn this down? 20 maybe? Wait, what's this? Okay, slip. All right, that's it. We did it. Wow, this is a fast little train. All right. Cool. All right, well, let's, can we turn on lights? Uh, horn. Uh, camera change. Okay. Now we want that. We want lights, cab lights. I'll turn off my lights. Spotlights. Backlights. Radio. Why is that blinking? Engine overheat. Oh. Emergency fire suppression. 18. All right, there we go. All right, let's check it out at night. All right, here it is at night as it slowly slows down because I'm trying not to burn up the engine yet. And uh, lots of little green lights. That's kind of cool. All right, we're back in here. Let's see if we can increase this. And I'm curious. Well, don't do that. I'm curious about the fire suppression. Can I? Yeah, clutch is maxed out. Okay, well, look, this thing is fast. How fast this thing's going? Holy moly! Okay. 
All right, let's see the little blinker go on again. Because I want to see the fire suppression. Suppression? Why am I sitting on the floor? Where's my temperature? All right. Do, 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 do. Come on. And day now. All right, maybe we'll catch on fire soon. That'll be cool. Yeah, let's kill the clutch. That should heat it up faster. Yeah. Burn! I want to see what happens. It's taking a long time to get hot. Okay, well, I guess it's not easy to catch it on fire. So I just went ahead and turned the engine off. I couldn't catch it on fire. It was going to take too long. But this is the BMK 1300 Light Freight by Sleepyhead. Let's get to the next one. So as I mentioned before, we are doing older community spotlights. This is, if you can recognize the design, is a Lorg's design. The Slepner Giant Multipurpose VTOL Airship. It says it is in need of maintenance. So because it's probably so old since we last, you know, had this submitted, uh, it may not work properly. Oh, this is bigger than I thought. Look how it's taking up the whole hangar. Okay, well, uh, let's see if we can get it going. So if this is designed like his newer builds, this should be simply a matter of turning on the main power switch, then going ahead and, what you call it, turning on the power, the other power, the ignition, whatever, and flying away. Let's see here. Okay. Let's take a quick look around here. Uh, see what's in the back. Probably many of you have already played with this. So we have a back. This looks like the door hatch. Put it down. And you can put it back up again. And that's just a back hanger. Okay, cool. And we'll lock it. And we'll cut. You know, actually, this is pretty big. But so far, not a lot of room inside. So I wonder if there is more room up here okay that looks like the cockpit we have beds we have letters this outside i'm assuming this is outside yes okay and we got a back door here and more beds okay cool what's this lights okay there we go so although it's very uh wide it doesn't seem to have much room wow Okay, this is where all the room is spent. Uh, it doesn't seem to have much room on the sides. It must be all engines. So, let's see. Power up. And there's the Lorg's Creations loading system. OS. And there we go. Got our map. Oh, very nice. Change screen. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Let's go back to that. Okay, there we go. What do we got here? Engine power. Um, switch to emergency power. New. We don't want to touch any of those. Close left side, close right side. I think everything's closed, right? I don't know. Uh, let's go ahead over here to the... Oh, okay. That's kind of interesting. If I sit in, does it spin around? There we go. Alright. Does it not spin around by itself? Okay, rotate rockets, left, right, up, down, after burst, landing gear, seat, left, right. Okay, so I hit number three. Oh, I actually have to hold it down, okay. Oh, oh, it goes past. Okay, so it's not auto. So, where's the engine on? It's on. There we go. Ooh. Oh, yeah, look, it's all engines. It's just a very long airship with big engines on the side okay so let's see here landing gear down adjusting engines still so we don't move until that adjusting engines is in a happy place get to a happy place get to a happy place hmm all right Ooh. what does that mean yellow lights okay that's a good thing right Maybe. Maybe not. Hmm. Come on, engines. What are you waiting for? Did I forget something? Uh-oh. I don't think I forgot anything. Afterburners. Lights. Ground brake. Hmm. Pump fuel out. Pump fuel in. We don't want that. Maybe I forgot something. Let's go look over here. What's this? Weapons? Unlock emergency fuel cut off. Huh. Oh. Okay. That took a long time. Wow. Okay. Let's get back in the seat then. Still not good. It's not happy yet. 
Maybe that's what he means by maintenance? I don't know. Although it is taking a long time to fire up, so maybe there's something up with that. Automatic. Do not touch. Only increase... Well, let's increase this. That's not working. Okay, don't touch that. It's just not saying that the adjusting engines is green, so... Maybe it is broken? Which is kind of a bummer that I waited so long to fly this. But I've flown all the newer ones, and they are amazing, so I assume this was amazing flyer as well. So we're just going to go and take a look outside and see if we can fire something off. Fire rockets, I guess? Let's fire some rockets. Oh, won't well, let me fire rockets. Wait, wait, wait. Is it starting up? Maybe it is. The engine's changed. What? Listen to that. It's almost like it's lagging, like all the code is lagging, and it's just slowly getting to where it needs to go. Very odd. I've never seen it take this long before. Okay, I'm pushing forward. I don't think I'm fit through that door. No, I should be. Oh, engines are stable. Alright. So can we move? Alright, come on. Move, 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 move. Yeah, we don't have enough power to get out, or these right booster engines aren't on, or something. Oh, are these supposed to represent, like, the, the engines? Maybe? Like, those are two, and those are two, and... The, oh! That's clever. But it's not really helping me. Landing gears down. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it's like it's underpowered or something. All right, let's go boost some stuff here. Let's go ahead and boost this. Yeah, give it some power. Lord is like, don't touch that, but I will. I'll touch it. I'm gonna give it a lot of power, and then we are gonna move out of here, maybe. All right, that seems like a lot of power. Alrighty. Into the pilot seat. And push forward. Come on. There we go. We're moving. We're moving. Ah! Woohoo! It lives! There we go. Another log's creation lives. All right, let's go ahead and put up the landing gear. Boom. There we go. So she takes a while to get going, but once she's going, it is a huge flying beetle. All right, so we got it going. Another log's creation, or actually an older one. But uh, we're going to go ahead and get to the next one. And remember, you can download any of the creations in the description below. So let's get to the next one. Oh, do the rockets fire? I still can't fire rockets. Oh well, let's get to the next one. So our next spotlight for today is the Helios SAR SAR Search and Rescue Helicopter by Cocky. And uh, looking very nice. Looks like a very classic build. I like it. And we're going to go ahead and see if we can get it going. Because, you know, that's what I do. And then things don't work and then... You know, we go to the next one. But we're going to start here and see if we can get it going. But uh, how do you get in? Key. Boop. All right. So far, so good. Got a nice little area here for saving people. We're going to go ahead. Should we leave the door open? Yeah, we'll leave the door open. Now, we we'll come over here. What do we have? We have a power on. And this is a radio. Radio. There we go. Talk. Hello, hello, hello. And that's it. Cool. All right. Now we're going to go to the cockpit. Now, I get confused on which seat I should be in for a helicopter. Because I noticed on one of the other builds, I got into this seat, but I had to get in this seat. Oh, look, it says co-pilot. Oh, I guess this is the right seat. Okay, let's go ahead and... No, I'll turn that on. Altitude? No? No. Oh, no. Everybody puts things in different places. I get so lost. Panels. That seems like a good thing. PID. Sure, that seems like a good thing. Disable parking brake. So we'll bring right on. Yeah, okay, that sounds good. Turbine jump start. Let's see, compressor, lightning, spotlight array, turbine jump start. I don't know what that does. But we'll do that. Okay, and activate autopilot. Oh, did we spin? 
I kind of moved to the left. Okay, well, hopefully we can get going here. Uh, I don't see a throttle. It doesn't say it's on the seat, but I assume it is. So we'll assume it is. All right, let's just... Fuel pumps seems like a good thing. Gyro? Oh, that seems like a good thing, too. Cockpit, strobe lights. Nah. Swap controls. Backlights. Cabin lights. Nav lights. Yeah. That looks nice. All right, so come on. What am I missing here? Is there a throttle? What's this? Current. Okay. Yeah, where's the throttle? Do I just kind of guess? I don't feel like it's actually starting. All right, I'm going to hit the up arrow. No. Hit the W. No. It's not working. I'm able to turn a little bit, but it's still not working. All right, we're turning. All right, well, that's easy. But we're not getting any more power for some reason. Am I missing something? Oh, turbine. Oh, okay. This must be my throttle? Maybe? Okay. Interesting. Um, you know, I'm a big fan of throttles on the arrow keys, just because it's really hard to click the button down here while you're trying to look that way, even if you're, like, stuck in first person. Throttles are just not good. You're always looking down here. That wouldn't be very good. Because you put your hand in a plane and push the throttle up, but inside the game, it's more into, like, trying to push the button while looking down, crashing into a wall, or whatever. So, come on. Come on, little guy. All right. Let's see if we can get it going a little bit more here. Come on, come on, come on. We're going forward a little bit. I don't want to go too fast. I'm afraid I'm going to hit the ceiling. Okay, we're at five. I think five is like the default, right? I don't know. Let's see here. All right. Go forward a little bit more. Come on. And uh, clicky, clicky, clicky. Impatient, impatient. All right, I'm pushing W to get it moving. That's pretty good. Okay. So, now can I hit the up arrow and go upwards? Up arrow? Up arrow? No. Do I have to hit the thing up above? Maybe it's all done by the turbine here? Okay. Up arrow? Oh, up arrow. There we go. So what am I at? I'm at like 15. Okay, cool. Looks pretty stable. Let's see if we can get it moving forward. Ooh, all right, forward and up arrow. There we go. So forward and up arrow has me moving. And uh, it's looking pretty good. Oh, let's go up a little bit more. Release the W and we're flying. All right, that's it. We got it going. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, just to prove it still works, so if you want to download this, it is in the description below, and this is by Cocky, and, uh, yeah, that's it, and there's the left arrow. Yay! Oh, you know what? Let's check it out at night. So, there it is at night. It looks lovely, and, again, this is the Helios SAR helicopter by Cocky. Let's do one more. So, our last helicopter for today is the IDCG HH-24 Sea Emperor by Toddy. And if you know Toddy, Toddy makes a lot of great builds, and he's got a little dude there poking on a wall or something, or walking with a cane, I don't know. But uh, always a great build, so we're going to try it out and see if we can get it going without any problems. Of course I'm not going to have any problems. I'm, I'm really good at this kind of stuff. All right, Ooh, there we go. we got the double doors that come down. Nice. And we'll just do a little jump inside, shut it, take a look at the back. We've got lots of room in this helicopter. And a seat back here to watch everybody that's like dying. Oh no, you're dying! And then come back here. We have a stretcher that can be lowered out. How does that work? I'm curious. Should we? Yeah, you know what? Let's get it going and then we'll try that. Oh, what do we have here? We've got screen power. Okay. And then back here we've got some view. I'm not sure what this camera's for. 
Okay, so let's go ahead and sit in the seat and see if we can get it going. And we got battery, check. What's this stuff? Ooh, let's just turn these on so I can see. And we've got transponder, sure, why not? Parking brake, wait, do we want that on? No, we want that on. Auxiliary generator, yeah, auxiliary battery, yeah. Compressor seems like an important thing. Auxiliary generator again, fuel cutoff valve. Wait, is that supposed to be on or off? I think it's supposed to be on, right? I don't know. All right, let's see here. Gear, switch control, panel backlighting. Sure, why not? Infrared, nope. Toggle screen, nope. Cycle radio mode. All right, that seems good. Um, where is our throttle? It's not the collective, right? I don't know. No. Okay, wait. Throttle. Oh, there we go. There we go. Rotor brake. Okay. Rotor brake. Do I want to push this forward? I don't know. Oh, there you go. Oh, okay. No problem. And we're just going to go ahead and maybe throttle up a little bit more, maybe? Uh, looks good. Probably want to push forward just a little bit. Okay, it's starting up. So far, so good. Let's keep going here. I'm not very patient, so I'm like wanting to push more throttle just to get it going faster. What's that? Oh, RPS. It's going up. Alright. It's moving forward. Yay! It looks really nice. Okay. Alright! We did it! We're out the door. Alright, so now, can I hit the arrow key? Maybe not. Do I have to hit the... No, it's up... Yeah, up, down is arrow key. Not going up. Do I have to hit more throttle? Okay, let's go one. Come on, little guy. There we go. Oh, wow, look at this one. You let go of that thing, it just stops. It's really stable. Okay. If we push forward... We get it going. So, arrow key and forward, and we've got it going. All right, so this thing is really stable, so I'm just going to come over here. And before we say goodbye, I want to go ahead and see how this works. What's that? Oh, cool. I'll turn that on. I want to see how this works. So toggle secondary, winch, connector, switch, winch up, winch down, door. Oh. Okay. So... How do I get this on there? Do I click this? No. Wait, is that that one? No. How do I let go of this? Watch that. No, that's that one. I want to do... Okay, that's that. Screen. No, that's not that one. How do I let go of this thing? There must be a way to let go of this. I want to pull you off. Okay. Huh. I feel like that should let it go, but it's not. Uh, I don't think it's this. Let's turn these on. This camera. That's cool. Okay, that's not what I want, though. Oh, did that do... Wait, what was that? Wait, there's another one? Where's that at? Oh, it's right there. Okay, cool. But... How do you let go of this one? How do you let go of that? I don't... I don't know. I don't see any way to let go of that. Connector... Off. Okay, we don't want to do that one. Okay, anything back here? No. Okay. Hmm. Maybe it's just not really for using it? Maybe it's... I don't see a button anywhere. Um, Alright, well... That's a bummer. I was tr gonna use that, but I guess we'll just see if we can get on the harness. Can we go down? No, we can't go down. We have to... Uh oh! Okay, well, let's say goodbye. <laughs> Alright, well that's it for today. This has been the IDCG HH-24 Sea Emperor by Toddy. And if you haven't done this already, go hit the bell so it goes ding-dong when I upload a new video. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. And I will see you next time. Bye!